Hello. Thank you for joining me. I'm going to do some refrigerator magnets. These are thin strips of magnets that had stuff on the front and I tore them off. You get them on the telephone books. Here is a six by eight inch wood frame canvas. I got it for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. No matter what size, it's always a dollar. I have to go there once a month to pick up dog pads. And it's always a gold mine. I go in for five dollars worth, I come out with fifteen to twenty dollars. But I get all kinds of nice, neat things, like these refrigerator magnets. Now, I don't know if you can tell, but they come in different colors, which doesn't matter. I'm going to pour on each one of them in the future, but make sure that all the underneath is taped. The magnet and the plastic underneath it can get quite messy. I know because I've got a couple of them that are nasty. Anyway, I picked up some more clear ornaments, so I'll be doing some more Christmas ornaments. I don't know when because I've misplaced them. Anyway, this is from my inhaler. It has a slit on one side, and you turn this, and it clicks, and you get one treatment. But on this op opposite side, it's got a little lip. See? Dog hair. See it open there, and it's got a little lip on it there, great for pouring, and it sits flat. So, I'm going to try that. I'm going to be using Deco Arts. This is my mixture. I'm having to use the water now because I've got my heat on and we got snow off and on off the Lake Erie so it's quite dry in my house in the summertime I, I used very little because my paint stayed dry uh, wet longer. Anyway, I got this folk art color shift. I got the blue and it turns purple. <coughs> and <coughs> My discount, I paid $3.50 for it. But they had it jacked up to $6 and something, so. I had to get one because people have been using it, but I don't see the outcome of the shift changing. So I decided to get, I was going to give it a try. Okay. I'm going to start out with black.
and then a color I called cranberry because it's as close to cranberry from apple barrel as I can get. This does, one of these do have silicone. I do not put silicone in the color shift. I think that might mess up it changing colors. I don't know if I have any of this orange left. No. Nope. I'm going to have to make more. I never remember to buy orange. Here is like burnt umber, really burnt. But it works. It'll work. As soon as I get rid of these miniature water bottles. I'm not using them no more. They're too flimsy and I just do not like them. I had a shadow from where I got a little drop of that in there. Of the sh color shift on the side. Too close to the same color. People seem to like blue and red together. I checked a bunch of sites and see where they got their most likes. So I'm going to be doing more of those myself. Okay. It's starting to come over the open end. I'm going to do it off the other end. It's kind of like a dirty pour. In a circle. Okay, let's stretch it. I 
I hope I have enough paint. I didn't ever use that container before. So I don't know exactly how much paint it holds. But I can see right now I'm not going to get anywhere with a dry canvas. So. Went to the doctors today. I'm in great health. Blood pressure was a little low. Especially for somebody that drinks a pot of coffee every morning. And I don't know what's causing it. Because I'm not on a whole lot of medication. But the doctor told me to get some vitamin D. These are my gloves from the uh, hospital. They had a... Uh, When I get, went to get my uh, test done, they had like a medical fair with people um, selling medical supplies. And it, the guy said, these gloves run um, $60 a box. And he knew nobody in that hospital was going to pay it. So he was happy to give me the samples. And they are quite thick. I can use them all over again. And I can wash dishes with them. I can do all kinds of stuff. I didn't want to get white in there, or my house paint. But it's going to come through, no matter what. It's already showing me it's going to come through. And all I wanted to do was run the paint off the sides. Some paint, I'm thinking it was my make-believe yellow ochre, has got cell, uh, silicone. I'm losing very little paint. I wonder if that shift changing paint you can uh, mix it with other r regular paint and it would come through. I guess that's going to be my next test. I'm trying to get this to come down.
I'm not crazy about the color mixture either. Okay. I think if I'd have left the orange out, I would have been fine. I'm going to try my airbrush. Because I can't get it to go any further. I stuck the hose to the breathing machine to my uh, air gun. It's not the little portable ones, but the bigger ones. They call it a nebulizer machine. scare anybody. If you don't leave the nozzle open, pressure builds up.
I don't like it. Okay. Well, if you don't like it, do something else. So I'm going to do a swipe. Where's my piece of plastic? Okay, let's see what we can do. If all else fails, do a swipe. Okay, it kind of went wonky at the end here. I want to make sure that I don't have raw edges. Color shift is coming through. Looks nice that way. Let me see what I can do as far as these magnets. try one more without dog hair. Okay, where's my tweezers? I gotta get all the edges covered because I don't want to dip it a second time. I got results earlier that was nice, but the original pour was funky. Okay, now back to this one. I'm going to see if I can pull some cells up. If you lose your torch and it breaks or whatever, you can go to the local tobacco shop in your town. and get another torch. I found that out the hard way. I want to 
want to fix this little corner here. didn't work out real well. This one, okay, this one's better. Not much. I don't like the colors. They're all mingling together. But I can always put another coat. I like this, but it's just a little bit too dark. Now, if all of it had done with that first half, I'd have been really happy with it. I know the magnets I'm not happy with. So, I don't like the white coming through. Well, I'm just making it worse. Okay. Now this part was nice, but not enough to keep this canvas. So I'm just going to scrape it off. I'm glad I just did it with a little one. The color shift costs so much. I just hate lo just wasting it. But, trial and error. Swipes aren't always the answer. And the magnets definitely they they went totally brown so 
I don't like them at all. Okay, let's see what I can do here. Get me an empty cup. Yeah, that's good enough. Pink. Black. Mixture of colors. Color shift. This is more red than cranberry. shift see this and that other is just about the same and a little more black I've got more than enough paint give it of swirls looky there I got cells coming up in my cup and my stick you see that look at my cup Okay. Let's see what this turns into. holes in the bottom of this but they uh, clogged up from the last pour I have no idea what I'm doing. The color shift in the pink have turned to purple. Which is cool. Now let's just move it around. Just a minute. Well, not a minute. I don't even think I had it rest a second. <laughs> Run all this back. Okay. Down this 
inside. I think I've lost practically all the color shift. So Yep, I've just got a little bit in the middle. Looks cool though. Now, just run a little bit off this side. Okay, we retrieved it pretty good. Uh oh, I'm slashing paint. I think it's pretty nice now. Eventually, if you keep trying, it'll come up with something you like. I'm going to see if I can't move some of this black to the middle. I like how we've got, we got a sad guy here. There's a few streaks of the color shift. Some of it's coming through there. I got cells within cells within cells. This guy ain't too happy. <laughs> 